Police investigating tonight after video shared thousands of times on Facebook shows an officer using a taser on a dog in Roseville. The video is really hard to watch. The dog's owner was the one that called police when it got loose in the neighborhood. Police say the dog was not hurt and was turned over to its owner. Priya Mann joins us live tonight. Priya, some are accusing police of using excessive force here. And Karen, there is growing outrage as animal activists say it's crystal clear. Roseville police officer continued to use a taser on a dog after that dog was restrained using a catch pole. And tonight they're questioning the amount of training officers receive before they respond to a call like this. This is cell phone video as Roseville police repeatedly taser a dog they're trying to restrain. The owner of the pit terrier called police Sunday afternoon. Neighbors started rolling as the situation escalated. Get in your car and go home. I already I will, you in the video, one officer is armed with a taser while the other is holding a catch pole. I don't know how to lock. In the 911 call, the owner told police the dog was recently adopted. And he snuck out through the back door and he just will not come home and I don't want him biting anybody. He doesn't bite, but he's pretty intimidating and he likes to run up on people and bark. Officers were eventually able to force the dog into their vehicle. This is a very easy tool to use. A five-year-old could use this. Detroit Pit Crew, an organization that rescues stray dogs, says the animal was not a threat. I mean, he's trying to get away. He's not charging you. He is trying to get away. He's fearful. He's scared. If you don't know that, what is, you know, then you shouldn't be in this position. The woman who recorded the video did not want to appear on camera, but called the incident horrifying. It, it's undescribable. There's really no words for it. I, it was just heartbreaking. I'm not out for blood with the officers. I want to see better training. And I did speak with the chief of police in Roseville. Chief Berlin says he couldn't comment, citing an ongoing investigation. It's not clear if the dog named Chewy was taken to see a vet, but we do know Chewy, that pit bull terrier, back home with his owner tonight. Reporting live from Roseville, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4. Priya, on that cell phone video, we could hear a woman yelling with police. What was that situation, and was she arrested? Yeah, she was. I actually just spoke with her. She says that she's facing three charges, including resisting arrest, disorderly conduct, and obstructing a police officer from performing their duties. All right, Priya Mann live, you. and we will find out what the chief has to say in the coming days about this.